Hi everyone, it's Dr. Kim. Expression lines versus sleep lines. So we make two different kinds of wrinkles on our face. I've told you before about expression lines. These are the wrinkles that we make in predictable places because of how we use our muscles of facial expression. So we do uh, horizontal lines in our forehead from lifting our eyebrows up. We make glabellar lines here from frowning in. We make crow's feet. We make vertical lip lines. These are all from our muscles of facial expression and these we can address with our toxins, Botox, Dysport, Nutox, or Xeomin. There's a whole second set of wrinkles that can happen in your face though that do not come from facial expression so they're not going to be fixed with a tox. And these are our sleep lines. These literally come from squishing your face into your pillow while you sleep. And often clients come in with a combination of both a sleep line is not going to respond to our standard toxins, our, our Dysport and our Xeomin, our uh, Botox or Nutox. So we need a different approach and we need a combination approach to them. There are some lines that we can address with filler, uh, including vertical forehead lines and some of the cheek lines, but often we need to combine laser resurfacing, tox, filler, and ultimately a change of habits and avoid sleeping on your face. So one approach isn't going to fix all of the lines and that's why it's important to use a combination approach to get maximal natural looking results.